In this video, we'll look at some examples of how Honey Code can be used. Our first example is a simple to-do list. So on Honey Code, you can make a simple to-do list for your personal use or your team use. The example we're going to look at today will be for a team use. So let's say that you're a manager of a company and you have to assign your employees work that they have to finish by the end of the week, let's say. Usually you'd send them emails or add it on a spreadsheet. But if you send them an email, it can get lost between the hundreds of emails that come in your inbox. Or if you, set, if you give them a spreadsheet, it's hard to read on a phone, right? That's where Honeycode comes in. Honeycode allows you to make a simple to-do list where the manager can add certain tasks that will be sent directly to the employee only, as well as giving them a custom notification. So this is a screen of an employee. I can see that I have to do these certain tasks. And the manager can add a task and assign it to the specific employee that needs to have that task. That way, the manager can give the task directly to the employee and the, the task will not be lost between the hundreds of emails or it won't be hard for the employee to read. That's, very, well, that's one very simple way that Honeycode can be used to make your business life more efficient. The second example that we're going to look at today is a vacation request. So let's say that you're a manager of a company again, and people email you asking for a vacation, for time off. Usually they'd email you, right? Or they'd, they'll email you or add it on a spreadsheet. But that can get lost just like a simple to-do list. Maybe the manager wasn't able to see it and respond to it quick enough. That's where this app comes in. This app makes it streamlined. The employee can see a personalized screen that allows him to submit a vacation request. And the manager can have a personalized screen that allows him to accept, approve, or reject. I mean, approve or reject a request. That way, it is a streamlined process and there is no confusion going forward. Also, we, you can make a history page. That way, you can see exactly how many vacations an employee took and when he took it, and why he took it, and was it approved or rejected. That way, these vacation requests don't get lost. And Honeycoda makes sure that you can have a personalized screen for each user. Now, let's look at it compared to a spreadsheet. This is what it would look like on your phone for a vacation request. And on top of that, you wouldn't get a custom notification on a spreadsheet. It would be very confusing and Sometimes it get missed, right? But look, if we look on this app, you can see how the dates are all aligned in, a, in an order, in descending order. But on spreadsheets, it's all random. So it's hard to read and figure out exactly when this employee went on a vacation. And that is just two examples of how Honeycode can be used.